Hello there! I've come with a royal proclamation from the neighboring king. After the war, he felt it necessary to send word. Shall you receive thine message? I am merely his humble messenger, so take it with a grain of salt. Um, sorry that Plan Update is so late this month, uh, due to circumstance, uh, this is actually my third time trying to film as well, um, but also just couldn't find time other times, because it's annoying, because I don't really, it's, you, you know, you know, you get it, it's fine, pish posh. Um, so yeah, the table, let's, let's just jump right into it. Um, so, this is a little pepper plant my mom is starting. Um, it's hanging out on the table. I wouldn't consider it under my care, uh, but it's hanging out here, so we appreciate its company. Uh, Gwen's doing pretty nicely. Uh, Gwen's budding a little bit, so I will have to, uh, do a little bit of trimming. Garfunkel's doing really nicely. I propagated Jose. Um, I'm not necessarily concerned with the propagation. I just didn't really have the heart to throw it out yet. I really should do something with this if I'm going to do something, but I just didn't have the heart to throw it out. I don't actually know if I will do anything. Um, but I needed to cut Jose because Jose was a little too unsturdy. Now he's much better, um, because he's a little too top-heavy. Uh, but now he's growing two, two new little sprouts right there, which is really fun. Addy's doing really nicely after kind of the scare last time. Uh, so yeah, I think Addy is growing very nicely. Eventually I will have to get a proper pot for, for Addy, but thus far, doing pretty nicely. Uh, Bluetooth, pretty decent, other than the stretching, uh, as normal. Eddie as well, I mean, like, stretching, which isn't necessarily unexpected. Holloway, doing very nicely as always, um, just really having a good time. Why am I kicking a glass jar? I'm gonna, I'm gonna upright the pickle jar. Um, Sands, as always, phenomenal. Uh, I appreciate, it's not that I don't... It's not that I like some of these plants more than others, I don't want to insinuate that in the slightest, but it is nice that Sands and Holloway just kind of do their own thing, and just are very nice, very... Not that the rest are problematic, I don't... Okay, I'm digging myself a grave, so I'm gonna stop talking. Cassandra, um, I did a little bit of pruning with Cassandra as well, uh, just so that she starts growing a little lower. Um, so right now, doesn't look amazing, but soon she will look much nicer, much better. Not that she is, not that she isn't already pretty. I'm not insulting my plants today, I swear. I really am not. I would like that to not be the case. I would like to, that's not your honor. That is not what I'm saying at all. Um, Manus, uh, after propagating, uh, is doing pretty nicely so far, at least I think so. Uh, yeah, I think Manus is doing decently. With the coleuses, the stems are getting quite woody, so I don't know if the same thing that happened to Manus is going to eventually have to happen to Gwen and Aldrich. Um, with Aldrich, uh, this has actually fallen over. So, uh, that's fun. So yeah, uh, Aldrich is just rocking the one stem now, which is fine. Um, R.I.P. to this little thing. Uh, let's, let's go, let's scoot ourselves around to get a better view now. So, uh, as you'll see over here, there's another plant as well. This is cat grass. Um, and the reason we have cat grass over here now is because Kit Kat has been going to absolute town on Samson and Charlotte. Just chewing ruthlessly. Um, now, Samson and Charlotte are fine, like... They, they will survive some nibbles on some of their leaves, but, like, it's really just intensive. So we've got some cat grass over here, um, and, like, this was intentional because the spider plants are, I think, the only plant on the table that the cats can eat, and it's not actually toxic for them. So it was intentional, but still, uh, it would be nice if Kit Kat didn't, like, devour them whole uh, from time to time. Like, look at this. This is intense. Ugh. I mean, at least she leaves Addy alone now, but, yeah. Samson uh, has some leaves dying towards the bottom, but I'm really not too concerned. The spiders, 
are just kind of doing their own thing in the corner. Um, and they're really, they, I don't know, they add a nice amount of leafiness and greenness. Um, so yeah, despite the perils of having to survive uh, Kit Kat's braidment, they are, they're doing quite well for themselves. Uh, and Aldrich, pretty, like, nice and leafy over here. Um, a little bit barren towards the bottom. So I don't know if eventually, I feel like with the growing cycle of the coleuses, I do have to do something about all these at some point. Maybe I just, like, boop. Maybe this is terrible. Maybe I just, like, ruined the plant by just ripping them out. I'll just get scissors later. Um, but I don't know, because the stem is getting very woody with this one as well. So I assume at some point I'm going to have to do the same thing I did with Manus to both other coleuses. I think that's just kind of the nature of growing coleuses in pots like this. Because coleuses, I mean, most plants generally don't live forever. They live and then they reproduce and then they die. So, yeah. I think that's generally it on the table. There's nothing else really- Oh my goodness! Oh, I'm so silly. Now, I'll to quickly direct your attention here. What? Two grow lights. It's crazy, I know. Um, my dad found one at, like, a thrift store for really cheap. Um, so now the whole table kind of gets to be covered with light, which is, which is kind of fun. Uh, everybody gets some extra, extra bonus growth. Not just um, Bluetooth and Eddie. So now the whole table gets a little array of extra light, which hopefully will assist them on their way. But yeah, everybody's doing pretty decently overall, I would say. Um, Kit Kat is on thin ice as my assistant gardener, but yeah. Generally, I'm not too concerned about anybody. Um, Eddie, I mean, not amazing, and I don't have too many concerns with Manus, but obviously Manus just has to start, like, growing and reforming. I've never seen a coleus, like, I, I've never planted a coleus shoot, but no, I, I don't think that's true. I think I'm lying through my teeth, because I feel like I did that in the same, like, I think that this one was uh, planting a propagation, so I think I'm lying through my teeth, but I haven't solely banked on planting propagations before. So it'll be a little different, but regardless... Uh, I think the table's doing quite well, and, uh, I, yeah, uh, I'm not too worried overall, so, thank you for watching, I hope that you appreciated the update on my dear plants, and I'll see you around, bye-bye, toodles.